Hi, my name is Nitsan Gadish and I'm at CES 2009 in Las Vegas to show you the ADXL 345. The 345 is Analog Device's first digital accelerometer and it features ultra low power consumption and comes in a tiny thin package. We've put the 345 on this demonstration board to demonstrate some of its features. First of all, you see that it's inactive and when it detects activity, the light automatically comes on. 345 also knows how to detect a tap from all three axes, and it knows how to detect when it's free falling. It can also detect double taps, and we're showing here how to use that as a switch. When I double tap it, the part goes into an orientation mode in which it can detect landscape and portrait orientation, both positive and negative. When I put the board down for a while, the part will detect inactivity again, and the lights will turn off. We have evaluation boards developed for the 345 to make it easy for the engineer to extract raw data from them without having to go into much coding trouble at first. We have this evaluation board with interchangeable face plates for different accelerometers. This currently exists for the 345 and for our 335, which is an analog accelerometer. We also have this evaluation system for the 345. This enables the user to configure the registers of the 345. It also enables the engineer to see real-time measurements in three axes. When I move the accelerometer, the raw data changes for all three axes, shown in green, white, and red. And finally, this screen shows power consumption, and it shows the advantage of having automatic activity and inactivity detection. When the part is active, it measures data at a high data rate and consumes more power. When it's inactive, it detects that the output data rate drops, as does the power consumption. Thank you for watching this presentation. For any more information on the 345 or any of our other motion sensors, please visit analog.com.